We all know America as the land of the free, America the democracy. The question is this, what qualifies something as an oligarchy or a democracy? And is America actually an oligarchy? Firstly, a democracy has free and fair elections to choose leaders, active participation of citizens, shown when citizens vote on policies, protection of human rights, such as own property and copyright, and fair and equal laws. Oligarchy has rule of the few privileged based on race, amount of money, etc. And few privilege have the influence to affect government decisions. On the surface, America appears to be a democracy because they check off all the check marks and shows no oligarchy traits. But we must look deeper to find the answers. First of all, rich people have the say in the government. And second of all, government and its organizations are in power. The first reason America is supposedly an oligarchy is because of the fact that the wealthy are favored in political decisions. Studies Vox and BBC conducted show overwhelming evidence of policies rich people supported being passed law. Fox states if 20% of wealthy Americans supported a policy, it was approved 18% of the time. If 80% of wealthy were in support, the policy changed 45% of the time. Average citizens saw no change in their policies despite the amount of people supporting it or not. This evidence shows that the wealthy are favored heavily over the average citizens and they therefore have more political power and say in government decisions. The second reason for America being an oligarchy is that citizens just don't have a say in the government. Freedom is taken away from the citizens when in multiple cases they are not given a fair say. In the Bush versus Core election, the votes were too close to count. Instead of recounting the votes, the court voted to dismiss the case. Everyone expected Gore to win, but Bush came out on top. The decision was ultimately decided by the Supreme Court, which means despite the citizens voting, they did not have the power in the say. By all the evidence, America is still a democracy. Why? Because America does not have to be a perfect or pure democracy to be, to be a democracy. America still technically meets all the requirements of a democracy, like voting and some citizen participation. And there are more freedoms than an oligarchy grants. So, in conclusion, while America is not a pure democracy, can it really be called an oligarchy? In the end, citizens made some decisions, but not all. Evidence points to an oligarchy, but there are still dem democratic tendencies not found in oligarchies. America is wavering between an oligarchy and a democracy, but for right now, it is swayed towards a democracy.